know. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo. Today is some sort of Stratter Day, but not really because we're going to skip the Strat today. We got something <laughs> really, really cool though. And it's also Super Bowl weekend. Woo! So I think Jen's going to throw up our blooper reel of me kind of doing one of these. Okay, okay. That was okay. It was awesome! <laughs> That was all right. Okay. No touchdown there. Woo! Well, either way, the Super Bowl is in LA. Yes. And it's going to be packed here. Um, so it'll I'm be so fun. I'm so excited. I know. It'll be cool. And then also, I believe on Monday is Valentine's Day. Woo! For all you lovebirds out there. Woo! <laughs> cool. <laughs> you know what's bad when you're talking to your friend? You're like, hey, man, Super Bowl Sunday. And I'm like, what about Monday? Like, Valentine's Day is Monday. <laughs> Priorities. <laughs> Mine are on football. Okay, cool. We do have a really amazing guitar. Now this Ooh. comes from one of our very special friends um, and also at Gibson. This is a Slash Les Paul Standard Limited 4 Album Edition in Translucent Cherry. Ooh. And it is a ripper. Mm, perfect for Valentine's Day. Perfect for Valentine's Day. Yes, it is. You could definitely serenade with this guitar. Yes. If you need to. <laughs> um, but really, really cool guitar. Uh, so the Slash Les Paul standard was created to commemorate Slash featuring Miles Kennedy and the Conspirators' first studio album with Gibson Records, which is pretty cool. Um, I know they're doing a lot of new adventures over there at Gibson, and Slash uh, signing to the label is so cool, and I just think it's such a great thing to have in the family so really really cool but let's talk about the guitar so you got that les paul shape um body materials mahogany a triple a flamed maple top um and then on the you have that single ply cream binding on the top of the uh top of the guitar there um you also have a kind of a well you have a mahogany neck but a kind of a 50s vintage profile they're calling it to me it kind of reminded me of it's definitely like a medium c but it also reminded me a little bit of like a like a 59 or 58 kind of profile but really really cool indian rosewood fingerboard um scale length is 24.75 22 frets um yeah let's take a look at the back oh also you got that abr i tuner tunematic bridge which is pretty standard um yeah mm -hmm. Really cool. We got the Slash logo up there. Um, also, uh, you got two humbuckers. They're called Custom Burst Buckers um, with Alnico 2. Um, and yeah, let's go over... The Case Candy? The Case Candy. Ooh. Whoa. So here's the record. Really, really cool. Vinyl's so awesome. Mm -hmm. And uh, really cool cover. And I think you can see yourself in it almost. That's really cool. Don't see me. Oh, oh that's messed up. Guitar strap. And uh, there's the pick guard if you wanted to put it on. I know Slash likes to keep them off. Um, but if you open up this, you have a signed photo of the band. We're both kind of multitasking here. Whoa. Signed Ooh, by the whole band. That's awesome. So cool. And a really cool shot, too. Mm -hmm. Gotta try one like that. Get a warehouse. Um, really, really cool guitar. It sounds amazing. It really does. Um, I've played the, uh, that song Slither before on other Les Pauls and it doesn't sound like this one. It definitely has that kind of slash motor sound. Um, and he's such a cool guy. So he congrats is. Slash, um, congrats Gibson, and uh, congrats to me because I get to play it. Woo! And uh, congrats to the people who bought these guitars. These went off the shelf in about two seconds. Yeah, I did. I posted it, yeah. No, it was on our website. I posted oh, it and it went it was, quick. It didn't even make reverb. No, it didn't. Went up to the website and by the time I got home, I live like five minutes away. <laughs> it was gone. Sold. Both of them. Mm -hmm. So, really cool thing. And yeah, I'm excited to play it. Let's take it up front. Let's Woo. go. Woo! All right, we're up front with the brand new Gibson Slash Les Paul Standard Limited 4 Album Edition. Really, really cool. And these guitars just flew off the shelf. We didn't even get home. <laughs> from work and they were gone uh, but we did say we would demo them and they also come with this really cool case candy um, and he's such a cool guy so let's do it uh, we're going through a Fender Pro Reverb uh, starting off on that neck pickup 
This just came in, so I'm not totally up on my my slash licks, but I'm gonna do the best I can. Let's see what happens.
Jackson slash Les Paul Standard Limited 4 Album Edition. Really ripping guitar. And uh, congrats to the guys and girls or whoever bought the guitar. Um, we had two of them, and they lasted two seconds for a good reason. Uh, check them all out at normansdirectguitars.com. And uh, yeah, I'm your host, Michael Lemo. See you soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs> that was awesome. Cool.